Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, we will see how to delete the data. So in previous video, we have seen how to edit data and update the data. So before getting started, if you are new to this channel, do subscribe. Hit on the bell icon so whenever I upload a new video, you will be notified. Do follow me on my Instagram page as well. Let's get started. So this was our code where we did our edit part here and yeah. This was a heading. So let's copy paste this and give this as delete. And here give a TD. Inside TD give a button. Button of type submit. Give the name as delete. Let's go reload and check. Let's close this tab. Reload. Let's remove this outline. Primary. Instead of primary, we'll give danger. Let's go reload. So you can see we have got in red color. So when you click on this, this data has to get deleted. Let's see how to do that. So here, what we have to do is we have to create an input tag because it has to take the particular ID. This has to take this ID and delete. So we are using an input tag and making it as hidden. A class form control and name ID value inside open close PHP. Just give this value, copy and paste it. If you make it to text. You can go reload and check. You will get the ID here. So we are going to take this ID and delete the data. So we have to hide this thing. So that is why we are making the type has hidden. Give name for button. So name is equal to delete button. I have given the name as delete button. Make sure your type is submit not button. Copy this and here it has to be inside form so form action code.php and the method is going to be post okay now cut this form paste it here now when user clicks on this delete button it will go to code.php with the post method so copy this button name and go to code.php here we have done the update code let's close this give a command line and tell delete code if is set of dollar post of that button when that button is clicked it has to take the id and delete here we have to give dollar user id is equal to dollar post of id and then we have to write the query for deletion so give variable name as delete delete query is equal to delete from users table where id is dollar user id then create another variable run query delete query run is equal to using mysqli query connect your database as well as delete query variable give a semicolon here and here We'll check if that data is deleted or not using an if condition. So if data query run is working fine, then display a session message dollar session of status is equal to then data deleted successfully. Else copy paste and tell unsuccess full deletion update 
let's go test our code give the header location as well so header location within single quotes location and give the page name where you want to direct this i'm giving index dot dot php if the data is deleted successfully and copy this paste it here and if the data is unsuccessful i am just giving the same page itself let's go and test our code go back reload let's change this heading to delete data go to index here instead of edit give delete go and reload now when i click on this id number six this six the data should be deleted let's click on it delete you can see hey data deleted successfully Let's go and reload our database and check. Reload, you can see the data Sana has got deleted. So I hope this video was helpful. That is all about how to delete data from the database. Like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.